Holy Father, when I wake up in this new day, I want to thank you for being able to see the light of the new day, the ray of the sun. Thank you, Father, for letting me know that my eyes can contemplate your creation. My ears can hear the song of the birds, the sound of the wind, the murmur of the water. May all join together, Lord, every dawn, every day that passes to manifest your praise before your greatness. Oh, Lord, creator of the universe, I praise you and bless you on this new day, Lord. I want to thank you because my ears can hear people who come to me today to talk to me. Thank you, Father, because my lips move to express my feelings of love that I feel for you. I want to adore you and bless you in this new day, O oh Lord, for what you are, O oh God, creator of the universe, who can do everything, who has done everything. Great, powerful, and merciful you are, O oh Holy Father, worthy of praise and worship. Thank you, Father because I can talk to you today and I can speak to all the people with whom I have to relate on this day. Oh, Holy Father, help me so that on this day my words sprout from my lips. May each of my words be like a palm to all the people around me. May my words edify, comfort and produce enthusiasm in people who are discouraged or who do not want to continue fighting for the difficult situation they are going through. Allow me, Lord, that with each one of the people whom today I have to address, only words of life sprout. Oh, yes, Lord, and not from death. Words of blessing and not of curse. So that everything Absolutely everything, Lord, what I say today, draw upon me abundance of blessings in spiritual and material goods. I praise and bless you, Lord, for this new beginning in this wonderful day and this meeting with you, Lord. Oh, Lord, I raise my hands to you, O oh, beloved Father, to give you thanks. Oh, Father, that with these hands I can work. Take them, clean them of everything that prevents the flow of any blessing for my life that you have for today. Allow me, Lord, that on this day I can enjoy all these blessings that correspond to me for being your son or daughter. I present to you, O oh God, these empty hands. Fill them with your power. Blessed Father, I only tell you that I praise you, I bless you, and I glorify you. And I ask that with all the people that I have to relate to during the day, oh God, today I can transmit peace with any of the expressions that I have to say to them through a word, that only words of love, happiness, joy to others sprout from my heart to infect them with that enthusiasm and make it a wonderful day, a splendid day, unforgettable, because you, Lord, take these hands and bless them. I appropriate the word that says, We know that all things help for the good of those who love him. Romans chapter 8, verse 28. That is why, Lord, thanks also for that past, because all those circumstances and situations that I have had to go through have served to make me an enterprising person. The triumph is with me. 
The prosperity is with me. The success is with me. Because I have your presence and you are everything. Thank you. Bless you, Lord. Holy Father, before starting this day, I want to apologize. I have sinned against you, Lord. We know that sin also brings ruin. Forgive me, Lord, and strengthen my spirit to abandon everything that hurts me. Oh Lord, today I beg you, bless God to help me. You know the situation, the circumstances. The money is not enough for me. The expenses are more than the earnings And today, I ask you to allow me to have more earnings than expenses, so that in this way, Lord, I can bring all that is needed to my family. Thank you, Lord. Lord, today I beg you never to let difficult situations, debt, lack of employment, make me deny you. Allow me to always keep in mind that all crises are for the good of those who love the Lord. Because you are there, making the best and a crop of blessings emerge. That is why today I receive that harvest of blessings that you have prepared for this day. I am just saying, Lord, thank you. Help me to always have my faith in you and in nobody else, that the circumstances, that the problems never make me leave you, Lord. On the contrary, that they serve to bring me closer and closer and praise you, bless you and glorify you. Let discouragement disappear completely, that they never return to harm my life, my work, business and family. Because today, I proclaim that I am free of all debt. You paid for it on the cross of Calvary. Because you bought me at a high price with your liberating blood. And I know that at the beginning of this day, I can proclaim and say I am free. Free from all debt, from all oppression, from every disease. Free from all ties of all cars, because you are, O oh beloved Jesus, the owner of my life, and with that death and resurrection, today you raise me up to change, to prosperity, and to freedom, both spiritual and material. Thank you, Lord.